Gunfire, crime scene tape, and a neighborhood in disbelief after a man was killed in a shooting in the Parkland neighborhood in broad daylight. I was like, oh my Lord. I feel sorry for the people that lost loved ones and I can't believe it. Officers say they were called near 28th and Garland Avenue just before four in the afternoon on Wednesday. When they got to the scene, a man had been shot multiple times. He was rushed to the hospital and died. Neighbors like Betty Ludwig say the violence has her even more concerned about safety. I'm too scared to come out here because I don't know if I'm going to get shot or, or if somebody's going to come by shooting or whatever. You know, I'm just too scared to sit outside anymore. Those shots were fired right here near Brandeis Elementary School. JCPS says there were students on campus and at the playground outside when it happened. And while school officials say they don't believe any students saw what happened, neighbors say these acts of violence can put others in the community at risk. A bullet don't have a name. A bullet goes wherever you point but it can easily be ricocheted and hit anywhere. Bobby Reed lives nearby and says more must be done to get people to drop the guns and choose peace. Stopped all the violence and fighting, shooting, killing, and they take the people and put them back in jail where they go. Or take the guns away from everybody and not have them. And Ludwig says she's hoping solutions will be found. It's hard knowing that these people's losing loved ones and prevent more lives from being lost to gun violence. Jamie Mays, WLKY News.